One of the cool things I like about Pal World is that every Pal in game has a partner skill. And not only are these useful, but are also stackable for the skills they improve. And in this case, we're looking at partner skills that boost your player's attack. The other good thing about Pal World is that unlike, say, Pokemon, you only fight one pal at a time, and so can fill your team with five pals that are all strong against that enemy you are facing. So if I'm fighting a fire type, I can fill my team with five water type pals, and so on. Another thing you can do is just focus all your attention on having one really strong pal, and that's what we're going to do in this video. And in my case, for this example, I'm going to use Shadowbeak, who I had already bred to be strong in a previous video. You can see he has 1498 attack as his starting attack. Since he's a dark type, there is one pal who has a passive skill that will boost dark types, so long as they are in the team, and I'm going to catch four of them just to see how much attack they will increase Shadowbeak by. That pal is Hookrates. You can catch them very early in game, they are very low level, and here is what happens when I add them to my team. You can see Shadowbeak has his attack 1498, but with a Hookrates in the team, that increases to 1589. That's an additional 90 points to his attack. How it works seems to be determined by a few things. First, the pal's level. So Shadow Beak being level 50 gets 90 points of additional attack, while the level 6 Hookrates in the team only gets 13 additional damage if I add another Hookrates, but the level 30 will get 29 points of damage increase. So the higher your pal level, the more attack increase they will get from this partner skill bonus. Second, the difference is different between every pal. Two level 42 Hookrates get slightly different increases, but it's within one or two points, and it's probably similar to how attack between the two same types of pal can be different, so there's a little bit of randomness based on the pal's base damage. Also, there's a difference between different types of pal. My level 50 Palladius only gets 72 points increase, compared to my level 50 Shadowbeak, who gets 90. But that could be because I've increased his base stats using the pal condenser and pal souls. Alright, so that is how the partner skills work for Dark, what about other types of PAL? I'm going to go then through the list of PALs that will increase your attack in your team for every type of PAL. So for Normal, you can either have a team full of Kremis or Ribunnies. For Electric, you can have 4 Sparkets in your team to increase Electric type. Fire is Ruby or Kelpsy Ignis. Ice, your only option is Foxicle, and I don't know about you guys, but Foxicle is broken in my game. It can't be found in the wild, you can only breed to get it. Water is regular Kelpsy. Earth is the mud. Grass is Bristla. You can also get a pal to increase the player's attack stat, and you can use either Gobfin or Gobfin Ignis. Lastly, dragon types don't have a pal that can boost their attack. So if you're looking to boost your Jetragun's damage, then it can't be done. Now there are two types of PAL which are significantly different as well. They can only increase their stats of one PAL, and they are Elizabeth. If you have four B-Guards in your team, they will increase the Elizabeth's stats, but it will increase both attack and defense. The other is Sui and Sweepa, and it's the same, it will increase his attack and defense. And as far as pals go, Elizabeth is not that bad of a pal in terms of stats for mid game, so having a bit of a bee colony in fights could be a good idea. But guys, that is it for this one, how you can use pals to increase the stats of your best pal in game. So if you're struggling with a fight, for example, against, say, a boss, then trying to boost the attack of your most powerful one with four other pals in your team that have the right partner skill, then I think it's definitely worth a try. If this guide was helpful, like and subscribe for more Pal World. 
leave a comment on your thoughts on the video and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.